Time now for Health Link. And there's some breaking news in the medical world today as a partnership between Seattle Children's Hospital and the Center for Infectious Disease Research has come together. Now, together they will formulate a new team to find solutions to the diseases that affect our children. Joining me now is Dr. John Aitchison, the president of the Center for Infectious Disease Research. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. You know, the first question is, you know, what is so significant about this collaboration? Well, the Center for Infectious Disease Research is a 42-year-old organization. We've been in Seattle uh, before Global Health was a, was a, a hub here in Seattle. Wow. And um, our founder, Ken Stewart, started us 42 years ago. And after 42 years as an independent research organization focused on infectious diseases that impact, impact mostly the um, developing world, we're now joining forces with um, Seattle Children's Research Institute Mm -hmm. to form a formidable team to attack these diseases. What kind of diseases are we talking about? We're mostly focused on diseases like HIV, TB, mm -hmm. malaria, um, some work on multi-drug resistance. Well, so what can, as a collaborator, as a team, what can you do now that you couldn't do before? Well, I think that we can leverage the, uh, the strengths of both organizations. We can have impact that we, uh, at scale. Mm -hmm. We can um, form you know, a team that has, um, has a very strong front against these diseases. Um, just impact at scale is the most Im uh, important thing here. Absolutely. Is there something specific, any specific disease or program that you're most excited about tackling? Well, I think that um, TB is a major, major problem. Um, you know, a quarter of the world is infected with TB. Mm -hmm and multi-drug resistance against TB is a very formidable challenge. Um, I'm excited about all uh, attacking all the diseases that we work on, but I think TB is a major challenge. TB is, and we, uh, this is something that in the United States we're, we're checked for, we're vaccinated for. Well, generally we're not vaccinated against TB here in the United States, actually. Um, it's mostly a problem in, uh, in Asia and other parts mm -hmm. of the world. Um, but it is, it has potential to be a major impact here, especially when we talk about um, drug resistant forms. Right, and that is becoming an increasing problem with many different Absol diseases. Absolutely. Why did you, I mean, it's no shock that Seattle Children's is an incredible reputation. But why did you choose Seattle Children's? Well, I think our missions are incredibly well aligned. Mm -hmm. um, you know, the diseases that we work on disproportionately impact children. About uh, 15,000 children die from the infectious diseases we study um, every year, every day, excuse me. And our missions are incredibly well aligned. They've got great expertise in the clinical side of things. We're more on the more uh, basic side of research. And so bringing these two areas of both clinical and basic research together, we form a very strong pipeline from the, from the bench to the bedside. Wonderful. Well, we have to keep in touch so we see what you do. Thank you so much, John, for being with us. Thank you very much. Cannot wait to see what happens next very with excited. this collaboration. Thank you.